409 Sports, brought to you by Golden Triangle Emergency Center, Orange. Good evening, sports fans. I tell you what, it doesn't get any better than this. Football is here. It's time to get started, and we have an incredible guest for you today. We're starting out in Kirbyville with the Wildcats, and I got head coach Seth Hubbard here. Coach, how you doing today? I'm good. We're excited to be out here finally. We've been waiting on this day for a long time. Yeah, I've been waiting for it, too. And, you know, we were just talking earlier. I don't think the sun was this hot when I was playing high school football. But, you know, you're, you're here from Dangerfield, your first year as head coach in Kirbyville. How are you feeling so far? Hey, again, the kids are excited about it. They've, they've bought into what we've been selling this summer, um, and we're just glad it's a little bit different. You put a helmet on compared to summertime, but it's ready to roll. Yeah. It's, it's go time. And, and speaking of the kids, you know, you got 22 coming back. Uh, nine of them were starters from last year. Uh, how is it? I know it's the first day of practice, but right. uh, how are you feeling so far? Again, it's good. You know, we'll go offense here in a minute, but defensively, that's where a lot of our guys are back. Um, you know, and you can't teach physicality. Those cats know how to do it. Um, so right now we're just working on, you know, getting to the ball, fitting it up, and, and we'll put the pads on and start popping on Friday. So that's what we're really waiting on. That was actually my next question. When did those pads go on? But so you have, uh, you know, a quarterback coming out, two really good defensive ends, and uh, uh, Ethan and uh, TJ. How is that going to affect how you guys plan when it comes to these games? Yeah, so defensively, if you have some ends that can, that can both play the run and get after the passer, that makes you uh, really dangerous as a defense because um, you can you're able to fit pieces behind them a bunch of different ways. Offensively, Jace, man, he brings so much to the table. He can spin it a little bit. He's a really good athlete. Um, people are going to have to decide, hey, are we going we gonna to account for Jace in the run game or are we not? It's a uh, He's a nice little weapon to have back there for sure. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that. And just in case you wanted to know, the Wildcats are going to be starting their season against Shepard, who they lost to in the playoffs last year. I know you're looking forward to that one, Coach. But I want to thank you for uh, speaking with me today, your first live interview. I think you did a great job. And uh, I'm going to send it back to you guys in the studio because we have some more football to talk about. I'm looking forward to it. Hey, that well, first game is going to be. Thank you. <laughs> good for them to get going against the team that they lost to. Hey, there's no other way to inspire the team. Head yeah. on, take it on, head on. We're